I like the white too. Wait, is that the right color? I'm gonna say I. Okay, it's. <laughs> Let me know when I'm on. Okay. All right. All right, so like I said, we're out here shooting with the Nikon F3. We got some Cine Seal 800T film inside of here. We're gonna get some shots with the Nikon F3. Um, Cine Boom filters all around. I got one on the lens that we're recording with right now. I got one on this camera. I have my A7R3 and my 85mm F1.8 in my bag. I'm gonna get a couple shots on too. I believe I have the 20% filter on, but the star of the show, she's back. We have Kirsten here and she is a full-fledged astronaut tonight. So. Um, this is kind of a random idea that I had, just getting an astronaut costume. We got a cheap one off of Amazon and just kind of going around the cityscape and getting like just some cool pictures um, with the Cine Steel 800T film stock. So um, I'm ready. We're gonna get started and see what type of shots we can get. Let me get a shot of you right here. Helmet on and hands. Actually just in hand. This is like your astronaut superwoman type ordeal. What are we at? One eight? Okay, that's cool. One, two, three. I hope you're in focus. One, two, three. I'm gonna do one more. Keep going over like right in the middle of traffic island so you're not getting yep so you're not in traffic completely hold it on. actually just hold it in front of you one two three Yeah. I, uh, he scared the sh So as we're waiting for the large pap sign to be turned on, we're gonna have her kind of stand up against the window here. I'll shoot uh, and try to get some of that LED lighting that's on the inside too. Um, also note, I did bring my uh, large LED wand just in case we need some extra lighting outside when it gets dark. Um, in case we don't have like a section where there's street lights or anything else like illuminating to help brighten the images a little bit. So um, we'll have you stand right over here. Actually, do you want to put the helmet on for this real quick? It's going to be like a headshot. Yeah, let me see what I can do here. What's your vision like on the inside of that? Ugly. <laughs> I can't wait to see what this shit looks like at night. Um, we yes. got yeah. The Nikon F3 also has like an internal, like metering section here, which kind of, if you halfway press the shutter, it kind of lets you know if you're underexposed or overexposed. Three, two, one. How hot is that? It is I told you. <laughs> um, actually, could you keep the keep the visor up for me? Yeah. Yeah, these are gonna look great when these street lights come on. I can't. What am I at? An eight. Okay, I don't want to waste this. Unlike my Mamiya RZ67 Pro 2, I get 36 shots with uh, this 35 millimeter format. So okay, stay right there. One, two. Three. Do one more. Now it tells me I'm underexposed. Cool beans. One, two, three. I'm gonna do that one more time. Trying to hold. My hands are still as possible because one over 15th of a second. <laughs> that is a very fast shutter speed here. But I just want to get that sun, kind of like that sunset in the background. 
One, two, three. So as we're getting closer to the sun completely setting, it's important to find the light where you're shooting film, digital, whatever. So we found like these cool lights up here. Uh, we're gonna position cursing like in front of one of those and try to get some shots like that. I have the 85, uh, millimeter on my Sony a7R 3 as well as the Moment Cine Boom 20% filter. So that's gonna give that huge blooming halation effect and kind of bloom all these lights that are around the area. So we're gonna put her right here and take a shot with this. Probably also take some shots too with the uh, F3 and go from there. I forgot what camera I had, yay. Is it on or off? You can have it off. Holy shit. Hold up, hold up a minute. Yeah, let me just do a test here. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do that again here. Um, yeah, yeah. One, two, three. One, two, three. Hold on one second. I might bump up the ISO here. Let a little bit more light in. Yeah. One, two, three. Neighborhood alien. I like. I Fuck like yeah. the. I like hell that. yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes. One, two, three. I'm gonna come in again. Oh, and then like the light is like reflecting the blue on the side of your face from the visor. Oh, these are going. Oh hell yeah. Okay, hold up. Yes. One, two, three. I'm gonna get one more. Let me cock that first. One, two, three. Sweet. All right, we're gonna get our abducted look here. All right, one, two, three. Ah, these are gonna be great. Um, that's why I loved you were actually able to just vision, like envision everything I was thinking of. I didn't even have like a clear idea, but I'm like, I think she'd understand if I just put some words together. Oh. <laughs> you know what, I'm just gonna get this one real quick. All right, one, two, three. What the hell was I using? You know what? <laughs> Last time we were out here, I was using a 18 millimeter lens, I believe. That's why it seemed a lot easier. One, two, three. All right, so I went and got my magic wand here. Um, I'm gonna kinda just have it sitting off to the side and now see what my exposure settings on my light meter inside of the F3 says. Fantastic, oh, this is what I'm talking about, okay. One, two, three. Cool thing about this is I can also change the color too. So we can add some of those extra colors in. Anyone wanna guess what I'm going for here? Wanna take a guess what color I'm looking for? Oh, uh, we went through all of them, so I don't know now. Yeah, I, I it up, but you wanna guess which one I'm actually trying to find? <laughs> no, but that's a good idea. It was this one, red. Red is orange. Known. It's okay. It's fine. <laughs> One, two, three. Jesus Christ. Okay. One, two. And I meant Jesus Christ in a good. I almost hit you with that. I'm sorry. Uh -oh. <laughs> two, three. 
Are you saying you look like Will Byer? Yeah. <laughs> Do me a favor, shh. sit like legs propped up on here. Um, so you're, yes. Yep. One, two, three. Okay, so if you look right here, we have these two little lights that are kind of reflecting. It kind of gives that abduction look again, that alien vibe, oh, it's a giant party bus right here. Um, but it does give this uh, like abduction alien type vibe thing. She did just get back from outer space, right? I believe you did. <laughs> sure. Hey. Sure. Just this morning, exactly. And she's already, see that's, that, that's dedication, already willing to shoot. Less than a 24 hour turnaround time. Oh, keep that for me real quick. One, two, One, two, With the actual Rimjet filter removed from this Cine Steel 800T, as well as like the Cine Bloom 10% attached to this lens, I'm really hoping for like that nice, like a lot of halation, a lot of like blooming effects to be with this. Stay right there, yeah. One, two, three. Actually, stay right where you're at. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's actually perfect, keep that for me. All right, one, two, three. We are in a parking lot for the last part of the shoot here. I wanted to use the City Bloom filters to try to get some shots using these cool like street lamps. It's kind of empty, desolate. We'll probably use our car headlights as well and go from there. Just swapped out the roll into another roll of 800T. So uh, we're obviously not gonna use all the 36 shots. We're gonna get some cool stuff. So check this out. What's up guys? I hope you are really enjoying the video so far. This has been super fun to put together and also just to participate in a shoot like this. So if you did make it this far, go ahead and type a DCP in the comment section to be entered in for a free raffle for a SanDisk Extreme Pro CFX Card Type B. It is 256 gigs. So again, go ahead and type in that DCP in the comment section. Let me know that you made it this far for a SanDisk Extreme Pro CFX Card Type B. 250 gigs, you'll be entered into a raffle and the winner will be revealed on my IG story on September 16th. So go ahead and follow me on IG if you haven't yet at Decaldwell Photography and all of that information is listed in the description below. And of course, if you're enjoying the video, go ahead and click that like button and the subscribe button if you aren't yet a subscriber to the channel. What the hell are you waiting for, y'all? Go ahead and click that subscribe button as well. I wanted to throw my voice in on this last part of the video just because I understand the importance of having a shutter release cable. So even though that I have my Nikon F3 mounted on top of my tripod, there was still some movement and shakiness when I was trying to uh, click the shutter and hold everything still. 
a shutter release cable will kind of fix all those issues as you see with the images on the screen. They're a little bit blurry, um, you know, not in focus, even though I did get my 50 millimeter uh, from Nikon really focused in at the time. Uh, it was still looks like it was jittery and I shot in a super, super low shutter speed. So again, I am understanding more and more each shoot the importance of owning a shutter release cable for instances like this, and I am definitely going to purchase one. But even though these images are quite blurry, it still kind of fits that alien, just cine seal aesthetic that I was looking for. But overall, the mix of the cine seal photos and the A7R 3 photos were fantastic. I love everything about this shoot from the cheap astronaut costume that we got from Kirsten. She was the perfect model for this vision I had. Uh, it just turned out phenomenal and I couldn't have been any more happier with both sets of images. So you guys let me know in the comments which you prefer, the Cine Steel 800T photos on the Nikon F3 or the A7R 3 photos. Again, across the board, we use multiple Cine Bloom filters from Moment and we produce some amazing images throughout this session. Also, Moment, if you're watching the video, go ahead and uh, hit me up. Let's talk about sponsorships. But again, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Let me know in the comments what you think of the photos, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.